Hello, Taipei 101. Are you going to be my friend? Good morning guys! Today we're here at Taipei City. This place, it seems like we're now in somewhere, an outskirt somewhere in the forest. But no, this place is in the middle around the city. This place is called Yang Shan. During the Japanese occupation period, this place was full of grass, so it was called the Grass Mountain. After the liberation of Taiwan, in order to commemorate Mr. Wang Yangming, in 1950, Grass Mountain was changed to Yangming Shan. And the, this place behind me right now is one of the attractions in Yangming Shan. The entrance that you have seen is the entrance to Xiaoyin Pond Waterfall. This place was switched with sulfur spring water, which is the cause that makes this waterfall looks milky white. The area known as Yang Mingshan now is formed by volcano about 700,000 years ago. The park is still featured with active volcanoes, winds and hot springs. The park is full of plums, cherry blossom, peach and much more flowers in this place. Many people go up the mountain to enjoy the flowers if you come here. Make sure you not meet that face. When tourists visit Yang Ming Shan, Yang Ming Park is one of the attractions where they usually visit first. Inside this park, it has a Chinese style garden, fountain, ponds, and a famous flower clock, which flowers will be changed every season. Nearby the fountain, you can take the shuttle bus to our next destination, Bamboo Lake. We're still in Yang Mingshan, and right here is Bamboo Lake. Around these areas, there are many gardens, and they display flowers for you to see and watch and sometimes takes picture with. During March and April, it is a season of color lily flowers. So today we're gonna go inside and take some pictures. The first flower field we are going to visit is Kao Jia Hua Tian Xiang. Visitors can buy tickets and strolling around the field. This garden is known for maple trees and Haidanjia. Although in April the Haidanjia is not bloomed yet, as its flowers bloom in May to July, the garden is still very beautiful.
two bus stop from Bamboo Lake, you will find yourself at Feng Jia Hou, where you can take a coffee bake in Mingyang Pu Leisure Farm. At the right side of Mingyang Pu, there is a pathway lead to more local restaurants and cafe. For this trip, we decide to have lunch at Guanshun Restaurant. After lunch, our next target is Chai Fu Garden. Nearby, there is an observation platform surrounded by mountains, with a view of seasonal flowers planted in many fields. As you can see, it is such a stunning view. For customers who wish to pick up color lily flowers, can pay extra fee for this fun activity. I did not participate in this activity, but I took some vibrant scenes of people who participate. The next location that we're going to is Xiao Yu Ken.
This path will lead to the main road, and we can walk from the parking lot to Xiaoyukeng Trail. The whole walk will take around 45 minutes. There's also a bus station, which you can take to Xiaoyukeng directly. Xiaoyukeng, located in the northwest of Xixing or Seven Star Mountain. This place is located 800 meters above sea level. There are many features here. For example, natural volcano air holes. There are also sulfur crystals, hot springs. And right here is a natural landslide terrain. This place is a very suitable for natural science ed education. Xiaoyukeng Visitor Center is closed at 4.30 and the last bus is around 6 p.m. If you miss the last bus, you have to walk down from the mountain. Please be careful of the bus departure time. After we have walked for a long time in Yangmingshan, we are now back to Night Market again. And this time, we are here at Shirley Night Market which is one of the very famous night market in Taiwan. Abe Spring Rolls is very famous, recommended by many YouTubers and local TV. The Spring Rolls contain bean sprouts, peanut sugar, cabbage, and barbecue pork. It's good. Another shop that we're going to visit is Zhongjia Fried Bao. This one is recommended by Mission Guide. This is happy tea, a combination between black tea and green tea. 